Blinded by clouds of smoke and deafened by ear-piercing screams of wounded warriors, soldiers push forth to earn the expert field medical badge at Warrior Base. Candidates from over 15 units throughout Korea attempt to take on the challenge to earn one of the hardest badges in the U.S. Army. Well, obviously it's a tribute to all medics. It's an accomplishment for those who pass, and I wanted to be part of that top tier. So uh, when I heard about this opportunity, I made sure I was able to come out and complete it and then uh, put forth the effort to actually get to this point, which so I'm proud of myself, definitely. With less than a 20% success rate on average, having dedicated NCOs within 4-7 CAV to push him made all the difference for Specialist Driver. My uh, first line sergeant was the one that ran the whole ruck with me, and that was definitely key in finishing first. He's one of the best soldiers I've ever seen in the Army. We trained for a couple months prior, at least once a week. So he had the basic skills down, so when he got here, he would know at least what he was getting into. I'm just so, so proud of him. Soldiers test their skills and proficiency in the medical field by completing lanes based on realistic events. What started off with 242 medics was down to just 18 by the start of the final event, a 12-mile foot march. Keep it going, keep it going. It's a long week. And um, seeing your battle buddies falter can sometimes break that confidence a little bit. Knowing that uh, I can pin that badge upon my chest is definitely something that I'm going to take with me through my Army career. Specialist Jordan Matthews, Warrior Base, Korea.